Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Brooke. If you're new here, uh, subscribe. I post new videos all the time. It is Tuesday morning at 7 a.m. I'm ready for work. Um, I can show you guys my outfit. I just packed my lunch. I packed snacks too. So this is Power Crunch Bar that I eat typically at like 9 o'clock. And then if I get hungry again, I pack in this pack of almond butter just so that I have something because I tend to get hungry when I'm like waiting around at work. I don't know. And then um, I made lunch. I made multi-grain pasta and then I um, sauteed up some mushroom and broccoli. And then I put some olive oil on all of it. So mm, I'm, I don't get hungry like in the morning, so I don't need breakfast if you were wondering. I pack it all in my um, never full purse. Oh, and I've been also obsessed with my Laneige lip mask. I'm finally on this gang after like a million months. This is my work fit today. Um, the blazer and the pants are from Express. The shirt's from Banana Republic and the shoes are from Misguided. Um, I could also take off the blazer, you know, and just have this like tucked in, but um, it gets chilly in the room anyways. I feel like the blazer definitely makes it a little matchy-matchy. I've worn this exact fit before with a different tank top um, on my channel, so if you're seeing that, you've already seen that but it's all good. So yeah, I just have a lot of makeup on because my skin's so bad. Uh, but the purpose of this vlog is honestly going to be me trying to get back into somewhat of a healthy lifestyle. Um, I've definitely slipped in the past few weeks just with work and everything. I always try to integrate balance. Like I've, I'm never like completely like just do whatever I want. Like it's always going in the back of my head like, okay, we're like order a salad today, like stuff like that. Um, but I'm going to try to get back on the grind today. Um, I'm going to show you guys when I get home from work some of the stuff that I've recently picked up from Lululemon um, or that Lululemon sent me because I'm so lucky to um, have some new items to show you guys uh, stuff that I can work out in. I have a gym in my apartment which is hype. We can go to that later probably. I think I have time today to get a good workout in which is nice. Okay well I'm gonna go to work so I'm not late. I tend to leave before like 7 7 10 just to be safe uh, to allow myself extra minutes in case there's traffic or something and if I get there early I get there early. I don't know where my sunglasses are um, but I think that that is it for now. Oh, I have my dryer and stuff going, but I'll tend to that later. Hey guys, so it's after work now. I'm currently sitting on my floor, and uh, I wanted to show you guys the stuff that I got from Lululemon. I'm about to go work out. I cannot believe I'm motivating myself to. It, it's been a while, just because I've been busy with getting into the routine of work and stuff, but I'm finally like in the routine, and I don't really have excuses left, and I always feel so good after I get a nice sweat, and I'm just taking off my bracelet. So I have a quick Lululemon haul. Um, the stuff that I'm wearing right now is Lululemon. And then I'm gonna just go ahead and hit it. I don't even feel like taking off my makeup. Sometimes I work out with it on, sometimes without. But honestly, I just feel more confident with it on from the work days. I'm just gonna leave it on. And then I'm gonna come back. Um, oh, I just made a quick piece of avocado toast and I had a hard boiled egg because I just came home and I was hungry and then I'll just have a lighter dinner. Um, I should have showed that, but I just didn't. So after this, I'm gonna drink pre-workout and then uh, go work out so that I have motivation. I'm probably just gonna do some form of cardio today just to ease myself back into it and get a good sweat in. That's like my favorite. I honestly really like cardio, especially if I'm jamming to like really good music. I don't mind cardio at all. Um, treadmill, Stairmaster, whatever. Um, I'm just gonna ease myself back into it just because like I said, this is the first day in a while so I don't wanna like push myself too hard and like hate myself. So, you know, it's all about balance but I also do wanna get a good sweat in. So all of these pieces from Lululemon are perfect for working out, getting your good sweat in, um, stuff like that. And um, a lot of them are more like summer oriented, I feel, just cause you know, it's summertime right now. So obviously that's the vibe. The first thing is what I'm wearing right now, which is I have the tags. This is the All Yours Boyfriend tee. You guys, I love this. I just slipped it on. I was like, holy crap, wait, this is actually so cute. It just fits like it's a really comfortable fit. It's baggy, so it doesn't like get you. I can like kind of show you. I feel like it's baggy in a sense that it's like, it's not, I don't like when t-shirts are cut like that because it makes me like feel weird about myself, which I'm trying to speak more positive about my body, um, but you know what I'm saying. Okay, I just like the cut of this one. Just a nice black tee. Um, you could tuck it in, you could do your thing with it. I like just wearing t-shirts when I work out, honestly. Like I like tank tops and everything, but if things are too tight on me, I feel worse about myself. So I prefer to work out on like baggier clothes. That's a personal opinion. Um, I know some people are different and they want to work out in like sets and stuff, but this is very like my vibe, especially cause I just go down to the gym in my apartment. Like it's super casual, no big deal. So yeah, I really like this. I got this in a size six by the way, cause I read online that it runs big and it definitely runs big. It's a relaxed fit. So just keep that in mind. Um, this is probably a good size for me though. 
I got shorts. Um, these are the Hotty Hot Long Rise shorts that I'm wearing right now. Um, I can do a better giant clip, of course. They're in this really cute green color. They've mesh on the side. Love the length of these. I've gotten these before. Um, I've definitely gotten these in a six before. I got these in an eight. Probably is my current size, if I'm being honest. But also, they're just a little more roomy. I would say size. Eh, I would say true to size slash size up in these. I feel like all of their shorts, if you want them to not be like super super skin tight, like probably size up a size just to give yourself a little a little room there. Next, I got a energy bra. Um, the long line. These ones are my favorite. I'm wearing it right now. Um, but I'm not gonna like take my top off. I'll show you in the try on haul. I got this white color because I have it in. I think I have it in black in the long line, which I love the long line ones just because I hate, I have a larger chest, so I hate when sports bras cut in a short place, and I love the style of this bra. I find it super supportive even for larger chest. Um, just keep in mind the long line is probably the move. I got this in a 10, and I think it's really, really a good fit for me, and I like the white color for summer. Next, I got a line joggers. I finally tried them out, you guys. This was um, like a riskier purchase, I guess. This was something that I wasn't used to. I got these an eight which was a good size for sure um i got them in what color is this it actually doesn't say what color i got them in but they're in like this bluey gray almost i wanted to get a color just because i have everything in like black and white and i'm like i'm so boring so i wanted to get some kind of color really like these i wore these out like to a movie night with my friends the other night with air force ones just super comfy and i think that they honestly make your body look like really good they're literally aligned leggings but the only difference is that at the bottom they have this jogger cut instead of being like all the way fluid through and then the waistband i guess but i don't know i feel like they're very similar like if you like aligns you would definitely like the aligned joggers um but just keep in mind that they're not really like a traditional jogger. They're more tight. So that's why I sized up and these are got an eight, I guess. Okay, next, um, I got a shirt. This is literally still in the package. I have not taken this out yet. I'm hype. Okay, this is the Sleek Simplicity Tank where there's no fuss ribbed tank as it is or turned around for a higher neckline. Oh yeah, that's why I really like this one because it, you can wear it like one way or the other. I'll probably wear it with the higher neckline. Honestly, I would rather show my back than show my front, especially when I'm working out. Like I don't want to have to deal with um, things happening in the front. Um, and I got this in a size eight. It says that it's like a slimmer fit, which is good, I guess. Um, this with like shorts or leggings or something, just like such an easy throw on workout tank. And I wanted to get this in a purple because like I said, I need to start doing some color in my wardrobe. Next here, we have my tried and true. I just got a new pair of a line, just leggings in general. I got these in a size six for reference. Um, these are just black. I think that these are the full length ones. I have, I believe the cropped version of these and then the super high version of these, but I don't have like just plain black ones as far as I know, or at least I didn't move them with me, which is just stupid on my part. So I was like, you know what? We're gonna do a repurchase. Let's get after it. Honestly thought that these would just be good. And they're just like, if you're looking for like a good legging, these aren't really for super intensive workouts. Like if you're doing like yoga, or, like just like a workout at home or I don't know, like if you're just doing abs or something, I feel like these are good leggings. But if you're like going to like orange theory or something more high intensity, I probably wouldn't wear the aligns, even though I still do love them. They're so great. They're like my, oh my God. It says naked sensation. That's literally the best way you can describe them. It feels like you're wearing nothing. So I love throwing all of this behind me. And then um, finally, Oh, we have a new a new bra. This is the Ignite bra. It says business in the front, party in the back, because it's like high neck, which I love when I work out. I don't have to worry about things like slipping out or whatnot. Um, I got this in black. It says that it's intended to do medium support, and I just wanted to try out a new bra from Lululemon, so I guess um, you guys will see this in the try-on portion. But I like the crisscross idea in the back here at the mesh, and um, I got a 10 in this as well which is like my typical bra size, I feel like, at Lulu. I almost forgot one last item. This is the Speed Up Short. I've tried these before, too. Um, honestly, both of these styles of shorts that I got, I have the order here. So I got the the first the first shorts that I showed you were the Hotty Hot, and these are the Speed Up, just in case you're wondering. I got these in an 8 as well. Um, these are, oh, I have these in a different, I have these in the three inch one, I think, and these are the four inch. They're a little bit longer. Um, all of the shorts typically are lined, so you can like opt to not wear underwear if that's your vibe. I usually do just because of like, I don't know, I feel more comfortable, but like I know people that don't. Um, I love all the pockets all around. I love the lemon shorts. I think that they're just such a flattering cut on the leg. Really just here for it. They make me feel so good and like confident in the gym. I would do like a black on black ensemble, like this black tee with the black um, shorts. That kind of would be a vibe. So maybe next time. And yeah, that's everything. Um, 
now I'm gonna go drink my pre-workout and get nice and sweaty. Thanks so much to Lululemon for sending me everything and uh, everything will be linked down below because I know you guys always ask for exact links to items. I wanna hook you guys up and um, so amazing. Lululemon literally sent me these items. Like what the heck is happening? Life is so cool. Okay, so let's clean everything up now and head to the kitchen. Okay, I'm aware that the lighting is garbage, but I'm um, literally, I just put my pre-workout in here. This is what I'm using. I haven't used it in so long. Oh my God. This has been like a minute since I've worked out and I can't find my shaker cup anywhere. I haven't used it in like five years, you guys. Uh, last time I did this stuff, I was like going to Orange Theory. I'm using the Alani new pre-workout in Rainbow Candy. Um, I really like it. And unfortunately, like I said, since I don't have the shaker cup slash don't precisely know where it is, I am going to have to just uh, pour some water in with it. So... And we'll mix it around. I mean, it like fizzes up and stuff. I drank so much water at work today. Um, I had one of my friends keep me accountable. Do that. Honestly, literally challenge your friends. Be like, let's keep each other accountable for water intake. It makes you drink so much more. I drank like three of these Hydro Flasks today, which is so good. So stay hydrated. I'm still using my mom's Hydro Flask, even though she comes here tomorrow. So she's going to want to pack. This is really good though, because I know tomorrow's going to be a crazy busy day. So I'm really glad I'm working out today. Honestly, it tastes really good. I really like this flavor. I tried the cotton candy grape previously and I think I filled that one up, but it was, that one was really good too. Later, I need to prep my lunch for work and stuff. The scrunchie looks absurd. Um, I'm probably just gonna get some vlog clips on my phone of me literally on the treadmill and stuff because I would never demonstrate how I work out because that just wouldn't be beneficial for anyone. I also came back to this package from LaCroix today. I already unwrapped it, but my coworkers are obsessed with LaCroix, so they are like dying right now. <laughs> Guys, this is so hype. I got like this t-shirt. We have this flavor at work and people are like, we have free drinks at work. Like anyone, you know, like the fridges are open. You can take whatever you want and people are obsessed with this flavor. And then I guess this is the new one. And then we got a hat and stuff. So I'm gonna bring all the stickers for my work friends tomorrow. And then who knows, maybe I will bring one of them, the towel. Their own baggage and their own shit, and they just do right. it for their own time. I'm listening to Girls Gotta Eat and chefing up, you guys. Um, I right now I'm cooking broccoli. <laughs> the song. I'm gonna put the broccoli on um, a salad for work tomorrow. This is my this is my salad for work. Um, a lot of you guys commented and said, do you have a dishwasher? I do have a dishwasher. I just have that out for like drying dishes that I hand wash. Like some stuff, I, like I didn't want to run this mug that I got from LaCroix through the cycle thing. So I like just have it out. Um, by the way, this is the best bread ever. I showed in my last video. Um, it is incredible. I've been just taking one piece, splitting it in half and doing like little avocado toast as like a snack. That's what I made before as my pre-workout and it was so good. So yeah, um, cooking up this broccoli. I literally just buy like the... I'm literally moving around with the knife. You guys are gonna crap on me. I'm no chef. Um, I literally bought this pre-cut, you know, broccoli, whatever, washed and like ready to go in the refrigerator section at Trader Joe's. And um, it's really good because you can eat it raw or cook it. I really like it cooked with some garlic salt. And this is a lot of it. So I'm gonna put half of it, like I said, in the salad for tomorrow and eat half with um, salmon for dinner, which I'm gonna pan fry. I put it in the oven yesterday i made the other half of it and it was really good so then i have the other half there and then i'm gonna just cook up the rest of the spinach too because i just have it i'm literally just like cooking through the vegetables that i have which is something that i really like doing i've been like challenging challenging myself to buy different things and then like cook it so that it doesn't go bad and it's honestly really fun i have all of the acne cream on right now because my skin is absolute garbage so i'm chugging water and if you guys are probably gonna be like spooked in my parents right now all right, I kind of like destroyed my salmon, just making it look okay, but yeah. And then I have half um, bread. <laughs> Good Cheers. morning, you guys. Um, next day, I'm running around trying to get ready because my parents are gonna be here when I get home after work. So like my apartment's gonna let them in. I don't have a spare key, which is kind of weird. Um, well, I guess it's not that weird because I'm living alone and my key is like one of those electronic keys. So um, they didn't give me a spare. But anyways, my parents are gonna be here like right when I get home. So I just wanted to make sure that the place is like fine for them. Um, I actually think it looks really good. Uh, I'll show you guys my fit for the day. I was about to wear a jumpsuit and then I tried it on and I just wasn't feeling the best in it. And I've worn this outfit before and I just know that it's like a solid go-to. 
um, I'm getting progressively more and more casual through the days. Just please bear that in mind. Um, my training room is pretty casual and we're not doing like on the job training today. We're just training in the training room and this is the consistency of like the level that everyone's been dressing. So I feel like it's appropriate. This skirt is from J. Crew Factory. I actually really like it. I love the little ruffle guy at the bottom. I can also pull it down a little more make it a little longer because I feel like it's just a little short this shirt I think is from loft I don't know it's just like a really good like business shirt and then my loafers are from misguided um, so that is the biz fit for the day and then gotta put away these hangers I need to do um, some sort of organization in this closet at some point um, if you guys would want to see like a video on how I organize my walk-in let me know I think that could be kind of a fun video you can kind of tell my skin still isn't perfect. I spent a lot of time doing the makeup this morning, like putting on a lot of makeup. Um, oh, I really like the Fenty Beauty Concealer, by the way. I've been trying this out. I've been like spot putting it on like my acne and stuff and it covers really well. So definitely check that out, especially if you use the foundation. I think they pair really well together. All right, I gotta have to refill my water. Oh, also, this is um, shocking news. For you guys who know me and have followed me for a while, you would know that I don't eat breakfast, but for some reason now that I'm waking up early, my stomach starts like really like audibly growling like to the point that like people around me are like you're a good sis at like eight or nine so i'm gonna try eating breakfast today um i'm just gonna make a little avocado toast situation i'll probably eat it just on the drive because i'm not really like hungry right now and i'm kind of in a rush um for work i'm packing this salad that i made yesterday you guys saw it it's really simple it's just like some broccoli um tomato i put a little moths in there and then I'm gonna pack this Power Crunch bar. That's what I typically eat at like eight. And then I bought these on Amazon, which I can link below. They're so good. Just seaweed snacks, but they're like really small pack. Mariah got me this as a going away gift, such a sweetie angel. Um, but I'm actually not gonna use this today. I'm just gonna use a knife. This is really good if you're cutting up like a really big avocado. Um, it's like an avocado cutter. She got this for my grad gift. She's, I miss you, Mariah. I'm trying to get her to visit. And I just toasted that bread that I showed you guys yesterday. It's like the Trader Joe's panne or whatever. I literally just ripped the bread in half. And then it creates like two. It's really just really good bread. That's how I could describe it. It's really satisfying. And then normally I would put everything with the bagel seasoning, but I don't wanna get seeds in my teeth. So I'm just gonna do salt and pepper. And I had a cup of coffee today. Maybe I'll pack one for the road. Who knows? Let's pack stuff up. next day I'm the worst yesterday was insane though I literally got home from work my parents were here we put together a bunch of furniture together slash I directed them of where to hang stuff and um, that was kind of our day it was very fast oh and then we went to dinner with a bunch of my friends from work um, had some drinks and ended up staying until like 10 10 15 so yeah, I went to bed at like 12.30, um, but I'm still up and at them. Let's get it. I wanted to show you guys quickly just a few of the new things in my apartment. I'm going to do like a whole video, probably like apartment updates and stuff, just because I'm still working on my room and like the bookcase and stuff. But I love the new pieces. Also, today is a business professional day at work. Um, we have like kind of like... I don't know what you want to call it, like a benchmark for training, and then um, we have a networking event later in the day. So, okay, first thing is probably this big mirror from Ikea. It doesn't look as big on camera as it is in person, but basically, like, the entrance is there, and then this huge mirror is here. I love it for outfit pictures. I love that it opens up the apartment. I didn't really have anything in this space, and I think this is absolutely perfect here. Coming back here, uh, that arc lamp is from Target. It's finally set up and in the proper spot. A lot of you guys were like, wait, you should put it behind the couch. Totally agree. It was just like I didn't put it together properly and stuff and my parents are the best and made it happen Specifically my dad and then we hung up the mirror again. It fell the last time uh, But we made it happen this time and it's like a wooden mirror That's from dormify a lot of these little things. I'm gonna do a haul of um, Like those pillows the blanket those pillows on the floor Those are all from urban and I'm doing a haul with urban at some point so to look out for that haul uh, my blazer for today um, that I'm gonna put over my shirt. We finally got two more chairs. 
Um, so I'll link them down below. They are Wayfair, so just use your discretion if you want to buy them or not, you know. Um, and my kitchen is just a little cluttered right now just because it's been insane. My parents brought like mail from home for me and stuff. And then <laughs> I've been eating avocado toast every morning. So I already had the first half and then making my way into the second half. Just filled up my water. Um, I have this Orgo customer success um, with just a little iced coffee for the road. And then I packed. Um, we're actually getting lunch today. So I just have my Power Crunch bar and some sea salt. And then if I get extra hungry, which I doubt I will, I have RX nut butter. I just like to have snacks on hand because I have been getting really hungry lately, especially like in the classroom and stuff, which I don't really appreciate. This avocado toast is so good. So I just take avocados and then I put pink sea salt, pepper, and the bread that I've been using is this Tuscan pan. Shout out Ariana and Gabriella again. They were the ones who told me about this bread. I don't really know, but apparently it's like pretty low in ingredients, so that's why it's really good. But it's also like just such a tasty bread, so I just take one piece and cut it into two, and it's like the perfect size breakfast because I don't want too much food. I also don't have too much time in the morning to like be cooking up like eggs and like a whole elaborate spread, so. Oh, we moved my mirror in my bedroom to here, which I think is kind of cool. It opens up the place, another spot for a little pick or something. Love the background. Um, bathroom, I don't think we did anything. I want to unplug my straightener though. I'm gonna show you guys even though I have stuff everywhere So please bear that in mind um, But this is a little bookcase that we got in here and then my dad actually mounted a TV on the wall So I bought the TV and then um, we mounted it up there which looks dope And then this bookcase I think is also from Wayfair so I'll link that below as well uh, Just goes with the white of the rest of the room. I was under the impression that I was getting a new bed. I'm not getting a new bed, um, so I'm keeping this like same setup that I have. It's just from LOL, the bed frame, and then the actual, um, this headboard I think is from either Wayfair or Overstock. I'll have to check on that. And yeah, if you guys have any questions, I mean, comment down below. I'll try to get back to you. Um, but I'm so hype about this. I don't know what to put on it. If you have any suggestions, hit me up. I'm so excited to be able to watch YouTube in bed or when I'm just in my room like filming videos or something. Well, not filming, but you know what I mean? I, I really am just hype about having a TV in my room. That's pretty exciting. And I think that is all. Oh, that clock on the wall is also from Wayfair. Oh, it just looks so good in here. Okay, now I'm like running late and I have to go because like I said, big day, fit. This is my suit from Banana Republic. So the pants are Banana Republic, H-belt, uh, Gucci loafers. Um, I really want to find a good dupe for them for you guys because a lot of you guys are asking about them. I just love backless loafers. I think that they're super comfy. The shirt is from ASOS, which I love because it's actually like it's sheer, but like you don't really like see my bra, which is really nice. Just straighten my hair key sunglasses from Princess Polly, and then I'm throwing the blazer over. So we got business profesh going on, and I have the scrunchie in my hair, so I'm gonna put it in my bag, but um, I've been using it like to put my hair up halfway through the day and stuff. Um, so I can't wait to uh, attack the day. Let's get it. Hey guys, I just got home from work. It was a really good day. Um, it's actually 6.30, I have a cauliflower pizza in the oven that's nearly done, and I'm drinking iced coffee because I'm about to go out just for like a drink or two, nothing too wild. Um, I have to cut the tag off the shirt, but I think I'm just gonna wear this like super super casual It's literally just these jeans that are from Topshop. They're like the Jamie jeans, I guess and then this uh, t-shirt is Princess Polly from I don't even know when um, And then my super got platforms that my mom brought up from home So it's like a lot of white maybe like some sort of like a sweater or cardigan over it. I don't really know Ugh, The food is ready yeah, I should not be going out right now, if I'm being honest. Like, this is a terrible, terrible, terrible idea, but I have FOMO, so I have to go, which is so terrible. Watching Remy and eating cauliflower pizza. Huge baby. Okay, well, this is by far one of my most irresponsible moments. It's 8 o'clock. I'm going out. I'm literally, I'm only going to stay for like an hour or two. Um, my Uber's on the way. Um, I think I showed you guys my fit, but it's exactly what I showed you before. Plus, I'm just wearing my crossbody bag. Probably gonna, I don't know if I'll vlog tonight when I get back, but we shall see. Okay, it is a very gloomy morning. Gloomy, gloomy Friday. Um, but hey guys, um, I can show you guys my outfit. Let's put some lights on. It's casual Friday. I mean, it's always casual Friday, I guess. Um, so jeans are acceptable, but I still try to look a little bit nice. I mean, I do my hair every day. I just straighten my hair every single day. This top is from Shop Love Street, I believe, forever ago. It's kind of like a sheer, just like, I don't know. It's like a, this button-down style, but I think the sheerness makes it a little more feminine. And I just tucked it in. This belt is from, I want to say, ASOS. Jeans are Topshop. I literally wore them last night, and I'm wearing them again. 
and then the it, they're just like my only jeans with no ribs i need to get some more so if you guys have recommendations for like good jean places throw them below and then these shoes are from jeffrey campbell and that's the fit they just have like a little heel to them i figured that they make it a little more dressy wow look at that light change okay um i also i'm gonna grab just a sweater because i don't know what the temperature is in the classroom today it's definitely gonna be a busy day um, last night was fun. I literally only had two drinks. I'm so proud of myself. Um, it was very social. A lot of people from work. Um, apparently I'm the YouTube girl again. Like, I mean, I obviously, like, I knew this would happen. But I was, like, standing over by the bar and, like, these people were, like, shouting my name. And they were like, oh, like, we work with you. And, like, we know you do YouTube. And I was like, wait, this is so weird. I don't know. It was so weird. But it's all good. Oh, uh, literally just grabbing this sweater from J. Crew. It's, like, my favorite, like, fluffy one. Um, I was gonna wear those jeans from Free People today, but they're just a little baggy and I was like, you know I'm feeling the more like tight jean like feminine vibe today I think I'm running early enough that I could potentially get Starbucks. I'm buying lunch today I always buy lunch on Fridays. That's gonna be like a like a consistent theme This sweater has me feeling like it's the middle of winter, but it's fine. The last night I like opened up my computer to check out because we have like um, another like bigger thing to do today I guess at work. So um, did that last well before I went out I guess um Packed up the work bag with snacks. I got seaweed. This is just from Amazon. I'll link it below. Power Crunch bar. And then I do have the RX almond butter. Um, I just like to stay strapped with the snacks. And then my friends, um, William and some others, wanted to try this LaCroix flavor that I was sent. This is the hibiscus. I think it's new. So I'm just putting some of those in my bag just so that they could try. Not bringing lunch. What else though? I need to refill my water. So I'm about to head out and I guess I'll just update you guys after work. I really hope it clears up today, but actually I remember reading that it was going to be gloomy. Oh damn, my umbrella's in my car and it's raining. Ugh, I'm like debating if I should wear a raincoat, but I really don't want to wear one. Okay, well I will talk to you guys after work. Okay, worst vlogger ever, but it's after work and we're ready to go out. Who is surprised at this point in my life? I actually need to chill with the going out and stuff because um, alcohol adds up in terms of calories and stuff and I um, I just feel like it's, I don't know, whenever I go through these phases of like intense drinking in my life, I get so puffy and bloated and like gross feeling, but I just love being social. Honestly, I love going out. I love staying in too. I'm like such an extremist though. Like I'm like, I'm going out all the time or I'm staying in all the time, so. This is, okay, I can show you guys my fit in the big mirror. I don't know, Jordan's bringing me a shirt right now I might change, um, uh, cause she's dressed in a more like, in a less of a summer outfit, but this shirt is from Urban. I actually think the shirt is really flattering cause it's like a low cut, but it's like scrunchy kind of here. Um, at the waist action, jean shorts are from Princess Polly, I've worn them before. Um, and then my shoes are my grease impulse purchase sandals and then I was just gonna bring like a crossbody I don't know. It's very casual. We're going to Fenway, which is where uh, The Red Sox play, but we're not going to the game I thought that we were gonna go to the game But we're gonna wait till the tickets are a little bit cheaper because tonight they were like $60 and like we don't I mean like we obviously like appreciate <laughs> what, Me and my coworkers like we want to go for the experience and stuff at the same time Like we could go when it's like a $9 game like another time because apparently those come up. So yeah, I have to clean my room tomorrow. That's gonna be a separate vlog for sure. That's gonna be like totally separate than this, like productive weekend or whatever the heck I'm doing. But I got these things for my wall that I thought you guys would appreciate. They're called mixed tiles and they sell them, like they have them in the middle of my mall and I was intrigued. So I went home and I looked it up and they're actually like custom prints that are, they're around, I think they're like 11 or $12 for a print and it's literally like a framed, it's not actually a canvas photo because it's like a printout of your photo, but it looks like a really nice, like the colors are really vibrant and they have a little sticky thing on the back. Um, so kind of like, like it's not going to damage your wall. What would you call it? Oh my gosh, I can't think of the name. Uh, command strip on the back of it. Um, so I printed out a bunch of photos. I still have more to hang up, but I love these ones. I mean, my friends, I just like literally stuck them on the wall there. Let me know if you think that looks okay. I kind of like it because I have no photos really in my room. And then, well, I have that one of me, Becca, uh, Taylor, and Alex, but that's literally the only photo I have in here. And then this is my bookcase, which I'm still working on. 
Um, but I just threw some pictures on there. That's the one of us in Greece, me, Gabriella, Ariana, and Danielle. I love that picture, the mirror picture. And then this is me and Mariah on spring break. I kind of like them on the bookcase too. Um, I do have more. I have more, so I don't know where I should put the other ones though. And I, I just love the TV in here. I set it up last night. I didn't go to bed last night until like 12. I came back and I was like FaceTiming people and stuff and that was just like such a throw my night off situation, but it's gonna be better today. Well, actually, I don't know. I'm going out right now. But tomorrow I'm gonna let myself sleep in until legit whatever and then just deal with it from there. I added some curls into my hair too for the first time in forever. It's honestly such a move when your hair is really dirty to like switch it up. Like if you normally wear it curly like to straighten it or to then curl it because once it's dirty it stays longer I find because like the like the curl will hold longer. So kind of a move. A little life hack. I don't know how I feel about the pictures back there because I kind of liked it with a blank wall. I don't know I might move those. We'll see. Uh, and I'll see you guys when Jordan gets here I guess.